bigger. Why do they always have to go bigger? In 2015, a scientist by the name of Dr. Henry Wu created a hybrid that was supposed to be the new main attraction, even bigger than the T-Rex. This hybrid was known as the Indominus Rex, a hybrid cross between the T-Rex and the Velociraptor, along with a few other components. The following year, Dr. Wu would take a sample of the Indominus Rex's DNA to create another hybrid by splicing Indom DNA with more Raptor DNA to give the hybrid a more Raptor-like appearance. The creature came to life in 2018 and was known as the Indoraptor. But what if Dr. Wu decided to take the experiment even further by extracting the dead Indoraptor's DNA with another dinosaur? This mega hybrid is a hybrid I like to call Indovenenum. This hybrid is a cross between the Indoraptor and the Troodon and is about half the size of the former. Like its Indoraptor parent, the Indovenenum can walk on both its hind legs and on all fours. However, unlike the Indoraptor and its grandparent, the Indominus Rex, who prefer solitude over groups, the Indovenenum is highly social and prefers to be in groups of up to 10 members. Dr. Wu created 10 of them and kept them contained to experiment upon them. The result is a deformed Troodon with quills running down its neck, back and tail with three fingers and one opposable thumb. They also have a terrifying pair of black eyes that glow in the dark at night, along with a venomous bite that would completely paralyze any creature that is unlucky enough to be caught in the jaws. The Indovenenum is also highly aggressive and intelligent, even more so than its parent and grandparent put together. Five Indovenenums together are just as powerful as one Scorpius Rex alone. Dr. Wu experimented with the 10 specimens and had them fight a T-Rex. The creatures managed to pin the creature down within a matter of seconds and began devouring it while it was still alive. Dr. Wu was both fascinated and terrified by his new creation and thought it would be best to keep these creatures out of public view.